I'm going to tell you a little bit what, about what happened to me in my life. We think, you know, everybody in Canada is rich and has lots of money. Well, we, we were very poor in Canadian standards. We were always in debt. Our family didn't know Jesus. We were not a religious family. And you know, when Jesus is not in a family, there's no peace. There's fights. Does anybody have fights in your family? Mother and father, brothers and sisters? We fought a lot in our family. My parents used to play frisbee with plates. <laughs> and when I became a teenager, like a lot of you, I began to look at the world. I began to look you know, of what I could get out of the world. I began to steal with my friends. We would go into, into stores and steal things. You know, there'd be so many huge fights. I got my nose broken in a fight at a discotheque one night. I was 17 years old. And they were trying to kill me. But I hid underneath a snowbank. Do you know what a snowbank is? It's a big pile of snow in Canada. I hid underneath it. And they didn't see me. And that night, God spared my life, even though I, didn't, I had turned away from him. You know, God loves you so much that even in your sin, he's waiting for you. He's standing by, just waiting for you to open up the door. But I didn't know that. And I started playing music. I started playing music. And I got very good at music. And I played on the streets. My mother said, get a summer job. Does you ever hear your mother say, get a summer job? Well, I went and I played on the street with my guitar case open, looking for money, begging for money. That was my summer job. Can you understand me or am I speaking too fast? It's okay? Okay. <clears throat> I didn't know I had an accent until I came here. <laughs> but you know, I learned how to speak in 50 Indian languages at one time. Watch, watch, I'll show you. I know how to say everything is okay. Watch. <laughs> 